Okay, so um, Radiant is the first cross-chain money market in DeFi, and uh, we want to have a full omni-chain vision allowing anyone to uh, deposit any major asset on any chain, any supported chain, and borrow from any uh, of our supported chains. So basically, as opposed to other um, protocols, lending and borrowing protocols that uh, your community may be familiar with, for example, Aave, Compound, and so many others, um, yep. you have the users have to deposit and borrow on the same chain. And if they want, for example, to uh, deposit on mainnet and borrow uh, on Polygon, they have to... Uh, borrow on mainnet, then bridge over to Polygon, maybe swap tokens if, if the tokens they're looking for are not available on mainnet. So they have to uh, do a series of cumbersome transactions. We at Radiant wanted to make it a seamless process. So if you want to do the same operation, you just have to deposit your collateral on mainnet and borrow directly on the destination chain on Polygon in this example to buy an NFT or do whatever you want with, with the borrowed asset. So that's basically what Radiant yeah. is in a, in a nutshell. And the, uh, the unique aspects of Radiant, which uh, set it apart from many of the lending and borrowing protocols that uh, people listening today will, will have used, maybe, it's that we are sharing protocol fees. So uh, basically, the money that we are getting, in the, the protocol is getting from the uh, interest paid by borrowers is shared among uh, the users in Radiant V1, it was uh, shared with the uh, lenders and people locking Radiant tokens. And in V2, as we will explain later on, it will be shared with lenders and it will be shared with liquidity providers. So we will be moving from single-sided staking uh, Radiant tokens to uh, providing liquidity. So basically uh, encouraging people or only rewarding users who actually provide liquidity in the form of an LP token uh, formed of, yeah. of with the different tokens that we are providing in a different liquidity pool. So basically, that's what makes unique. That what that's what makes Radiant unique, set apart from all the different uh, lending and borrowing protocols that you know. Of course, then there's additional utility because the Radiant is a the Radiant token is a governance token, and uh, you are part of the DAO. You can vote on the future direction of the protocol. And, uh, well, basically in V2, we have some cool mechanics that I'll be explaining uh, during the AMA. But that's, in a nutshell, the unique aspects that we always highlight at Radiant.